Hello everyone. I thought about something and I think it is good to make a video about it. Have you ever tried sleeping and started to have demonic dreams? demonic dreams to where you kept on waking up so let's say the first dream came and you woke up then another dream came after you tried going back to sleep then you woke up again let's say within that day you kept on waking up over and over and over again or let's say you are afraid to go back to sleep as it seems because you continue to have horrific demonic dreams the thing you should do is uh wake up get down on your knees and pray You may not be used to praying for a long time, but you need to practice it. You may need to pray longer than five minutes, longer than 10 minutes, maybe longer than 20. Pray as long as you have to so that you can sleep well. There is no sense in just allowing demons to torment you. No, 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 no. You fight back with prayer. That works with me. Sometimes I may pray for 20 minutes, I guess. I am not so sure about the time limits. Maybe an hour, maybe longer than an hour, depending on the demonic attack. But don't let demons take away your sleep. I believe what they try to do is torment you. Make you as, I believe, I believe they will try to torment you and try to make you as miserable as they can. Fight back. You know, you may need to fast, pray, keep on praying. And you may ask um, Kevin to give me examples of what I can pray about. Okay, God, please forgive me for all of my sins. These demons, witches, or whatever it may be that is tormenting me, I command them to leave. I lose peace upon me. I lose peace all in my room. I lose sleep and comfort. Any witch or demon, any demon that is messing with me, I command you to leave. I bind and cast you out right now in the, in the name of Jesus. Stuff like that and you keep on praying and you keep on praying kevin what if i run out of things to pray then you stay on your knees until you find out more things to pray kevin i may repeat myself over and over you stay on your knees until you find out more things to pray until you don't feel terrified until you can feel that demonic presence that may be there leave you listen you stay on your knees until things get better until you can sleep good there is not really a time limit i hope this makes sense like today, 
I was trying to sleep and I kept on waking up. See, I am no stranger to demonic attacks. I am no stranger to it. I learned sometimes you need to wake up and pray, 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 pray. Sometimes I may do it for an hour, maybe over an hour, maybe longer than that, perhaps. What you don't want is to do nothing and allow the demons to keep on messing with you. I believe, let me say this, I believe we are in a spiritual war. So you may get rid of that battle, I guess, for the time, but no matter if you fast, no matter you pray, I believe demons are going to continue to fight us until the day we die. So I prayed and I was able to go back to sleep. Does it mean demons are not going to mess with me no more? No, I believe they are going to mess with me more, but we have to constantly fight back, if you understand what I mean. Kind of reminds me of Tom and Jerry. You know, the cat and, and the mouse, Tom and Jerry. Like, I believe almost every episode, Tom would chase Jerry and Jerry would, I guess, do things to, I guess, to attack back, I guess. It is kind of like that, constantly fighting back, not exactly in that cartoon cartoonish way but i believe we are always going to have to fight against demons and we need to get used to it i hope this makes sense to you never just give in because i believe if you give in i think things will get worse so let's not be lazy and do what it takes to find peace. Let me stop here. May God bless you.